So my, uh, I don't know if I have all the clips I put it this far and I'll do some work on it. I might just take the videos, a uh, clip from me and uh, Gabe and then all the clips from the night and just put those. But I don't know, I already got like 19 minutes for a video. So I might, I might drop a 30 minute, uh, 30 minute vlog like the first time ever. That bitch working? That bitch is working, I hear it. That bitch is working, I hear it. We got Gabe and ST. Hey, what you doing? Which one is that? Mm -hmm. You gotta put it on the, uh, put it to the pre-soak first. It's, bro, it's not working, that's what I said. It still says deposit 425. I deposited the money. Nuh-uh, did it hit? Yeah. Did it charge you? Yeah. It ain't working. It, says, it says deposit 425 still. You, it will be counting down from four minutes. Because the water always runs with these. I was about to hit my car with the water too. Oh, does it? Yeah, it always runs. That's why I come through and I just hit it with those cigars. That's your cash app card? Mm -hmm. Yeah, my cash app card wouldn't work either. Thought you had a real card. I ain't using my real card on this bitch. It probably is a scammer. Chill, you about to... Run that bitch through. I don't have anything on my cash app card. I was going to go to the one on the side. Did you lower this bitch at all? Mm -hmm. right. Why you got curb rash right there? What happened? Nigga, what, tent, what kind of tent did you get? Five in the back, 25. Jesus Christ. But I had the Nothing, five percent banner. You took but it I got out. pulled over and they tried to, they tried to hit me with two points. This bitch looks regular, man. This is, this is. Sad. Man, look at it. This is sad. We got fucking blunts on the floor. Which one? Which where you? You want to go? You want to go to one on Overland? Try that one. Lando says that one works. Uh, yeah, Lando says that one works. But and it has a, a free cigarette. That's just lace for sure. So all you got is intake right now. And then the intake's not on yet. Oh you can put the intake on this thing. Yeah, I don't know why all that shit's right there like that. Somebody's having a party though, I heard that shit. That's it. Yeah, he got 20, uh, 24. That Z01 is a bitch though. We put exhaust on it and the intake already. Uh, no, we did exhaust. Yeah, we did exhaust and the intake and we're waiting on uh, some other things. That bitch is nigga. The scat different too. We wide by the scat. That bitch is different. That one's hard too. But yeah, we put the 4G. He had the 4G auto's uh, power coated black. And then we did the 3 inch lift on the 24. 
and we did five uh, percent all around. And then uh, we uh, uh, paint matched everything that we could, and I think he's running the LED uh, front emblem on it. There's a few different things we did, but this is gonna be cool exhaust, some rims. He already has an intake. Uh, and there's even do down down pipe. Uh, probably have a good turbo on this thing. He's got the rain guards. He's got tent. I think even you can even do lower springs. Even we gotta get coil overs. This thing would be cool. And then, but you gotta you gotta do the blow valve. You gotta you gotta get the noise out this bitch. To don't tune, huh? I'm not trying to do too much. They don't tune it how they do it with the burbles. I don't like that burble tune shit on these STs. They're not that really cool. I've seen too much. Got all the car meets. So, doing the rear brake pad jobs on the on the Jeep. This thing's trash. Um, lug nuts are a different size on this side than they are the other. Terminal was loose. A bunch of bullshit. Yeah, I don't want to talk about it, but 2017 Jeep Cherokee ass. 2020 20, 20 Jeep Compass ass. I've worked on them both in the past week. And they're ass. I don't like Jeeps. I don't like Honda guy. Jeeps are ass. But we're gonna go ahead and get this side finished up. Get the car back to my mom. Yeah. Yeah. Awesome. I think the green accents go so much, but this car clears it so well. All right, chat. So. We got this fucking around jack stands again, uh, for one. We're gonna loosen up these fucking, uh, whatever you call these again. That's probably fucking splitter rods or some shit. Uh, I'm gonna put the splitter rods down a little bit so that it looks a little bit lower again. And then, uh, took the wheels off. Uh, gonna spray out the coilovers. It's got a little bit of sound, so I think there's probably a little bit of dirt or debris up in the coilovers, so we're gonna spray all that out. Um, we're gonna degrease them and then we're gonna hit them with some PP blaster, wipe them all down, and then we're gonna hit degrease them again after we PP blast them. Cause the PP blaster is just gonna seek into spots in these two, stuff like that, and it'd be good. Uh, I might try to put a dust cover back on this side. I might steal it off one of the other cars. It does not have a dust cover. Uh, I am running skunk two coils. Uh, I'm not all the way slammed. I wish I could. Um, and we're gonna check the exhaust out. Uh, there was two holes on the exhaust uh, flange that we drilled through to make a, a new hole for new bolts and nuts. I don't know why we did that, but uh, I'm putting uh, some gasket on it, some gasket maker, some ultra copper uh, gasket maker for exhaust. Uh, put that on there, let that dry till I leave. Uh, might clean up the engine bay. Um, might put a few tabs and zip ties uh, on, the under, on the under tray, uh, just so that it's not flapping around, stuff like that. But yeah, we got her up in the air. Uh, you gotta go pull out my my buddy's compressor real quick, put the air gun on it, and then spray out those coilovers and clean them up. Um, other than that, we're not doing too much. I want to put the AC compressor in and then change out the pulleys that I have on this other motor over here because I know they're probably better than the pulleys that I have. Uh, I just want to take off the this main pulley right here and the bracket. Then I'll I'll spray the bracket, clean the bracket off, and the Ireland pulley right there. I'm gonna need that. It might not be an issue. I just may not have it on there on the Ireland pulley all the way. And, uh, or the Ireland tension or whatever the fuck you call it. Uh, but yeah. So we're not really doing too much. I got it in the air. Uh, we're just checking everything out, make sure everything's good. Um, you know how it is. Got issue there, issue here. We're just making sure everything's fine. Uh, I don't know. And then this car, not too much yet. It's still got the wing risers on. I did the bumper uh, cut, did the back seat delete. I got to order a few parts. Uh, right now I'm sending down the fuel rail and sitting down uh, one of the, uh, the engine mount uh, mounts. So these two engine mount mounts on the, on the left passenger, I'm sending these down, I'm gonna respray these and do the fuel rail and then I'm doing the battery tie down. And then i um, still working on that exhaust manifold for this car, but I got it, I got it pretty dialed down with just one bolt. So I'm gonna check that, make sure that's all tightened down and put some gasket maker on that flange behind it. Uh, I got gasket and stuff like that. I just don't want no leaks at all. I want this car to sound perfect, even with one bolt. 
Uh, so yeah, I'm trying to figure out the dust, the dust shield. I might pull it off of this car, or more likely, I'm just probably gonna pull it off of this car. Make sure, just pull the dust shield off of this car real quick, just to see where the bolts are at, stuff like that. Just because it, it'll make it easier. You never know if the dust shield really does come in handy, but you don't want to f figure out where you. Oh fuck, the dust shield would have came in handy. So you know, if you can't take it out, just take it out. Um, I might be working on this. I'm gonna take that wing off of this car, reprime it, re you know what I'm saying, and then. These are for this car because this wing has no inserts anymore. Uh, I got the I got the bolts in there and I got it held on by fucking faith, and it's yeah. Um, but yeah, we're not doing too much, so just uh, stay tuned for the rest of the video, and we're just gonna keep on chugging. Uh, I'm still thinking about um, so I'm probably gonna office this off. I don't know how I'm gonna do it, but I'm probably gonna office this little area off and maybe take a little bit of stuff out of here and put it over there and then maybe create a shelf or something. And I don't know. But what I wanna do is I wanna I wanna build a wall from right here all the way to this wall right here. I'm gonna leave this open, maybe put like a gate or something right there, and then uh fence I mean and then a uh, wall wall from that wall right there all the way to like maybe like this yellow line. Just because that's where I pull in at. And then maybe stop it, like, maybe put a wall, like, right here. Just so I have a little entrance and I gate it or put something there. You never know. And then I have an office inside of that. And then this is just my whole little bay. So, I don't know. We'll figure it out. They're still trying to offer me this little, this whole spot right here. I already fuck with half of it. So, we'll figure it out. But, uh, yeah. That's all I'm doing in the video. So, I might, I don't know. I was going to go to a car show or stuff like that. But there's so much work I got to do. And then I got to get this motor swapped ASAP. Uh, I just got to finish getting all the stuff unplugged and all the uh, hoses off and stuff like that. And I, my Ukrainian guys over there, they have a uh, they have a, uh, an engine hoist that they'll let me use for a day or two or however, or however long I need to use it. But once I get it and once that's out ready to come out, it's going straight in. And once it's going straight in, I'm going to e-check and then I, I just go get the tax for it and ready to go. But yep. Um, yep. All right. So... Uh, we lowered the, uh, the splitter rods, uh, we sprayed out the, the coilovers, we re-greased them, uh, we didn't touch the back, we're gonna touch the back tomorrow, we'll fuck with them tomorrow, um, I put some more gasket maker on the, uh, exhaust, and I loosened it and tried to, like, what's it called, I'm gonna, uh, hit the, hit it with the hammer on the one side of the, uh, that the, uh, bolt is broke, maybe hit a, hit a seat a little bit better, um, I might just loosen it again, and then hammer it, and then tighten it again. Or I might just hit it now, see what happens. Um, I got clean this gasket stuff. Uh, I, uh, I I sprayed the uh, the whole uh, the um, the whole bay down with the uh, air gun. I hit the radiator and the condenser with it. Um, tomorrow we'll lower the back. I kind of lowered the front just a little bit. Um, I might do something tomorrow. I don't know. I know I gotta work Monday. Well, I know I work Tuesday, so, um, but we're going to get the wheels back on. I'll get it back on the ground, get them torqued down, uh, and then uh, we might just call it a night. Um, there's not really too much I can do. I'm not, I don't want to, it's, it's already getting so cold out. I don't know if I'm going to, if I'm ever going to get to put in this condenser this, this season. I may or may not. I may just sit in here. That caliper I got to put back on here. Or, yeah, on there. No. I don't really care about that. Uh, it's either the uh, uh, the pulley on the starter's going out, or um, it's uh, it's either the pulley on the starter's going out, or uh, I'm actually gonna clean the pulley a little bit. Should the pulley be clean? I'm pretty sure it should be. No grease at all or slip. So. I'm going to change out this pulley right here and then this idler pulley in, in a day or so. Uh, but when I do that, I might as well change the compressor. But um, everything's pretty good. I'm just dialed. I'm going to hammer that, that exhaust a little bit and then uh, start wrapping up, go home and eat. Um, I still gotta get, I'm still going to get a tire for this. So I'm going to pull this probably same tire off tomorrow. It's I think the spring fucked up on the coilover, so it's making it weird. But the collar, but the shock, the shock collar spring... The shock, the shock collar right here, this one was loose. So um, it could have been the reason why this was like shaking up and down because this was loose. But I tightened it as tight as I could with, with that. I put a, uh, a cheater bar on the end of the, the, the wrench and everything. Um, but 
Still working on this. I got an engine hoist. I'm gonna be able to take that out. Uh, fenders on this one. Uh, this one's still getting prepped to get the engine in it. We don't really gotta do too much more for this one. Uh, gotta get that painted. Gotta uh, probably fix some some spots. Just gotta go through. I gotta buff the whole car. And I gotta get this, this this sticky shit off. I get some goo going. And I gotta take time and do shit like that. But this will be the daily. Cause I get that one, and I'll be able to take this one fully apart, get the dent fixed, get the turbo kit put on, get everything I want to do to this car, you know? Uh, so I do have the driven sliding, driven slider brakes, and I just put some brand new fresh brake pads on, and a video or two gone. I am running the, the Skunk 2 coilovers, uh, the Street Pro S. Um, they're pretty good on me. I like them. Um, front and back. Uh, I love Skunk 2. Uh, got the Skunk 2 Rad. Um, I got the filler neck, but I wasn't able to run it. I think this was making it leak. I don't know. Something was leaking, and I was just trying to take everything apart that I could that, so try to diagnose it. Uh, I, I may stay with this coated, I mean, with this uh, Ram air intake. Or I might run this AEM AM, AM coat air intake. I don't know. It also could be for that car, but I could just swap the, the intake. But either way, I might not even need an intake anymore once I go turbo, so I don't know. But, uh... Yep, I mean, not too much, yeah. I'm just gonna uh, finish getting uh, get finish getting buttoned up with this, sweep a little bit, and get the fuck out of here. Um, might uh, add some more clips tomorrow. I really don't know how many, where I'm really at with the clips and how long this video is, so uh, I may even, before I leave, I may even organize some of this stuff as much as I can to try to make it look better over here. But uh, other than that, man, just, uh, I want you guys to like, comment, subscribe. Uh, I appreciate everything you guys have done for me. Um, Try to get the views back to where they need to be. So I need you guys to, when you guys get done watching this video, I need you to send it to everybody. Moms, sisters, boyfriends, sisters, girlfriends, cousins, whoever. Send it to whoever. And let's, uh, let's get these videos going viral, man. Let's, 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 let's just make it happen, you know what I'm saying? But just know you guys are with me and let's just do it. Shit, nigga. I don't even see that shit, nigga. I'm still gonna give away the scooter, I promise I am. Oh, my fucking camera's dirty. Give me a second, I don't know. All right, I think I cleaned it up. <clears throat> All right, boys, so. So, long story short, uh, Labor Day, drunk, bored, uh, chilling, not doing much, lying around. Um, all three cars are here. Black car, I finished everything. I, I, whatever I said in that video earlier, I mean, that clip from earlier, I did. Uh, it came out well. There's still a little bit of sound going on. Man. It's fucking chilly as fuck out here. It's like fall already. But, uh, whatever I said I was gonna do in that clip, I probably did already. Uh, not much more to do. Uh, may call some buddies over or some shit. I don't know. I'm going to shopping. Pretty Yeah, I don't know what I'm doing. I'm just keep watching YouTube videos and I might vacuum the whip or something or wash it. Who knows? But it's chilly outside when I wash it. I got a fucking sweat and a hoodie and it's still a little chilly. Um, <coughs> shit. <laughs> uh, I don't know. Yeah, I might either vacuum or I didn't bring the game system, so. I'm just starting to chill TV today. Uh, it's warm in here, it's cold out there. I might shut the door how cold it is out there. Um, yeah, other than that, just trying to fill time for the clips. Um, yeah, I don't know. Um, they, they got a yell. Nice little fuck with. Um, yeah, I don't know. Afternoon. Okay. Pulled out. Transmission this morning. Also. I don't know what I'm gonna do with this video. I know. Okay. I know this video might uh, give me on, give me on camera. I know this video might. Uh, I don't know if I have all the clips I put it this far. And I'll do some work on it. I might just take the videos uh, clips for me and uh, Gabe, 
and then I'll cook in the night just for those. But I don't know. I already got like 19 minutes for a video, so I might I might drop a 30 minute uh 30 minute vlog for like the first time ever. But uh, I don't know. Let's see. You got to just keep getting close to it. Tomorrow night I have all night to work on anything, so I ain't gotta be at work till four. So we can uh, we can go pull off that that boat, or if you go to Corey's tonight or something tomorrow morning, whatever time you go over there, I can go pull that boat off with that uh, impact, and we can um, get some footage going. So uh, get that uh, get the timing set. We gotta just uh, keep uh, turning the um, we gotta just keep turning that motor over till we uh, get it to where that timing is perfect. Cinematic the whole time. You go back to uh, regular. Then, hey, I was low key fucking with that cinematic. It's open here, left foot. I'm about to try to make this quick so you can get the fuck out of here. I think we're just gonna go up chat though. Go up 611. That's the fastest way. We gotta watch out for 12. We see them if we got a drop window because them niggas ain't gonna fuck with me and chef though. I don't know why. No speeding. I got this speeding the whole time out there. If I didn't have to wash it, I would've just went to Broadway to your street, to your house, and could've just Too much of it because we're gonna get some more cooked at the uh, car meet. So, what do you think you got like two, three minutes of it? Just about it. Well, How much bigger? Oh, where's the uh, well, it's, it's technically a stock, it's a hybrid, though, ain't it's it? A, it's a hybrid. That bitch hard. I forgot to say, it's not shooting. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that bitch hard. So, what uh, you got? Oh, uh, okay, okay, that's sick. Yeah, because you park, you park, it's, it's funny because you know the rubbish room? Yeah. yeah. You park right on the outside of that fence right there. That's yeah, just so yeah. sick. I fuck with this bitch though. What kind of rims are they? The Coney's? Yeah, I want some. Yeah, it's sick. What's up with this? It's a 360. See, this is bigger than what I thought you had. I thought you had the little slim one. What model is this? See, nigga, I texted you. I said, "What's up with that 360?" That's what I thought. I thought I meant uh, Insta. Well, I forgot. I forgot to send you. Is this cheaper? Or is it more expensive? Is it better though? Do you know who you're talking? This nigga's a goat, nigga. I mean, nigga, look at you, man. This nigga got jeans, man. Hold on, I mean, nah, I ain't. The only problem I have with it is just the app. Sometimes you treat. Fuck you, nigga. Nigga, put that Lexus over here and start revving. Nigga, Jordy's just so sexy, dude. Hey, I just think they're all my feelings, guys. Or all my tires, dude. I'm running everybody today. Who are they? Who are they? Who are they? Nigga, they're... Nigga, they're just so sexy. What does that mean? So